Hello and thank you for watching Power to Change Crusades with Pastor Jim Doherty. I read out of John 15 verse 5 today, the words of Jesus as he says, I am the vine, you are the branches. He who abides in me and I in him bears much fruit. For without me you can do nothing. Think about this. Some people today say that they're spiritual. But I say if you don't have Jesus, you're not spiritual because Jesus says right here, he says, Without me, you can do nothing. Without me, you can do nothing of spiritual value. Without me, you can't be spiritual. Are you connected to the vine? Jesus says, I am the vine and you are the branch. The thing is, think about a vine and a branch. If a branch is disconnected from the vine, the branch is gonna die and it's gonna wither up and dry up. Jesus wants to be connected to you. He wants you to be connected to him. Because he says here, I am the vine, you are the branches. For apart from me, you can do nothing. I pray today, if you're not connected to Jesus Christ, that you would recognize that you need to be connected to him. Think about a, a car without a motor. Man, it would take a lot of energy to get that car to a location, especially if you pulled off on the side of the road and you didn't have access to use your motor, you would have to push that car pretty far. Well, think about this. You can't go anywhere spiritually as a Christian. You can't go anywhere spiritually at all without Jesus. You need to be connected to him because Jesus says, without me, you can do nothing. Let me just say that Jesus does not want to be second in your life. Jesus does not want to be in the back seat of your life. He wants to be first in your life. For apart from him, you can do nothing. I want to encourage you today, if you're not connected to Christ, if you're not right with God, I want to welcome my thousand plus subscribers here on YouTube and this broadcast. If you don't know Jesus, I invite you, all of you that are watching around the world, to get right with God and be connected to Jesus Christ. The Bible says that we've all sinned and fall short of the glory of God. The Bible says that over 2,000 years ago that Jesus Christ God's Son was sent to the cross on our behalf. As the Bible says, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him will not perish, but have everlasting life. You need to get right with God. Jesus Christ died on the cross for your sins. You can be connected to God through Jesus Christ. You can be connected to Jesus and have a relationship with God. It's not enough to be, quote, spiritual. You gotta know Jesus, because he makes you spiritual. He makes you a new person. He makes you on your way to heaven. Jesus said in John 14, six, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man comes to the Father but by me. He says, look, you can't get to God the Father, you can't get to heaven unless you know Jesus Christ. You gotta be connected to him. Again, Jesus says, I am the vine, you are the branches. You can do nothing apart from me. Clearly, if you're part and connected to Christ, you're a Christian and you're a believer. We need our nourishment from God. We need our nourishment from Jesus. We need to be in the word of God, taking his word and applying it to our lives and growing in him. Just like a plant, you water a plant and you wanted to see it grow. You also put the plant in the sun so that it can help grow. We just need the living water of the Word of God. We need the living water, Jesus Christ. We need the S-O-N, the sun, every day to shine in our lives and shine on our lives. As Jesus is the light of the world, he says, if you follow me, you will not walk in darkness. If you want to get right with God, would you pray with me and repent of your sins? Turn from your sins, as the Bible says, and turn to Christ that times of refreshment will come from the presence of the Lord. Get right with God right now and believe and put your trust in Christ and give your life to him and be connected to Jesus. Pray with me right now and give your life to Jesus Christ and believe in your heart right now. Pray with me now, Lord Jesus, I know that you're the son of God who died for me. Jesus, be my savior, be my God, be my master. I want to be connected to Jesus Christ and I put my faith in Jesus now to save me. You are the vine, Jesus, and as a branch, I want to be connected to you because I can do nothing of spiritual value without Jesus. So please be my Savior, my Lord, and my Master. 
and my God. I put my faith in Jesus Christ and I ask you to forgive me of my sins and make me a child of God. Fill me now with the Holy Spirit and cleanse and take away my sins by your blood that you shed on the cross for me. Thank you for loving me and forgiving me and calling me. Help me to follow you now in Jesus' name. Amen. If you just pray that prayer, asking Jesus Christ to be your Savior, to be connected to Him, would you call me right now, 1-800-973-5543. You'll see that on the screen right now, 1-800-973-5543. Go on my website, please, at power2change.org and click the link, I gave my life to Jesus Christ. We've had many come to know Jesus, and I'm looking forward to many more, but maybe you just put your faith in Jesus Christ. Welcome to the family of God. Read your Bible, get to know Jesus, get connected to Him, grow in Him, and get rooted in Him. Because Jesus will not turn His back from you. And as you grow closer to Him, amazing that God grows closer to you. Jesus will draw near to you as well. I pray for you, and if you have a prayer request, please write me. And if you would like to support our ministry, you can also go online at powertochange.org and click on the link, I'd like to become a partner, or donate there online. But I want to encourage you as well. I look forward to seeing you on our next broadcast. Hope to see you here, maybe there, or in the air. God bless you and keep you. And let's keep our eyes on Jesus and be connected to Christ.